It's senior night for Naperville North as the Huskies host Sandberg in the regular season finale. The Huskies enter after beating Homewood Flossmoor in a thrilling overtime game, while Sandberg lost to Naperville Central. Both teams enter playoff eligible and are looking to improve their seeding going into the postseason. First play of the game, Jacob Bell throws it right to Brock Petaway, and the race is on towards the end zone. Petaway makes a few miss and gets taken out of bounds at the two-yard line for a 63-yard catch and run. A few plays later, Jacob Bell rolls right and throws across to Nick Manzardo, who's in for the touchdown. North leads 7-0 early. Sandberg comes right back. On the first play of their drive, Anthony Shelton finds Charlie Snorek over the middle who gets past the defense before being tripped up at midfield for a 29-yard gain. The drive would go down to the red zone where Shelton throws backwards to Quinn Durkin and he pushes into the end zone for the touchdown to tie it up at 7. A couple north possessions later, Bell takes the ball and pumps before throwing it deep to Quinn Morris, who extends and makes the catch in the end zone. The 35-yard touchdown bomb puts North back in front, up 14-7. Now tied at 14 on the next Husky drive, they are forced to punt, but it's blocked by Jaden Weaver. The ball bounces at the 25 to give Sandberg quality field position before the half. However, on the Sandberg drive, Shelton looks to the end zone, but his pass is picked off by Edward Mumford, who gives the Husky defense a much-needed takeaway. On Sandberg's next possession, Shelton goes deep again into tight coverage, and it's Mumford again with the interception. He brings it out to midfield where the Huskies kick a field goal and go up 17-14 at the half. In the third, North forces a punt and the ball bounces to Zach Malley at midfield. The Huskies evade a handful of Eagles and pushes deep into Sandberg territory for a 24-yard punt return. North capitalizes a few plays later as Bell throws deep again for Finian Bertag. The tight end makes the catch through contact and crosses the goal line. The Huskies are up 24-14 to open the third. Sandberg storms back and are now down 24-21 as their run game makes an impact. Luke Basiorka takes the rock and runs past the defense into Husky territory before finally being brought down inside Husky territory. Now down in the red zone, Basiorka pushes up the left side and rumbles his way in for an 18-yard touchdown run to put the Eagles up 28-24. After a touchdown to give North a 31-28 lead, the Husky defense steps up. Shelton looks over the middle, but he throws another interception, this time to Husky Aiden Paparja. It's one of five interceptions thrown by Sandberg on the night. On the ensuing drive in the fourth, the offense converts as Bell throws to the back of the end zone, where Ian McConaughey comes down with it inbounds for the score. Both teams would trade points, but Naperville North comes out on top with a 44-34 triumph over Sandberg. The Huskies finish the regular season at 7 and 2 and await playoff seeding. You know, you know last week we didn't play as well on defense. We gave up about 60 points. We know this week we had to come back a little bit harder in practice, work hard and you know, paid off. I I'd say that uh, it doesn't matter who we have in, all of our guys can score. So that's good. that's hard for other teams. Um, you know, it's, it means a lot to all of us. We all play for each other. We all got each other's back, so we do it for each other. I shifted left because I saw his eyes go left, you know, and then I see him look back. So I immediately just start running because I'm like, if he's looking there, there's got to be a guy. Uh, I see the guy in front of me. I think it's going to him. He throws and it's high, and I'm like, I can go get it. So I just go, I just go take it, you know. I'm running around. Should have went down in the end zone, but uh, you know, I wasn't thinking. I just happy to have the ball.